Happy Friday, everybody. How are you? Um, doing a video today on uh, three cards I received recently. And it's actually two days in a row now I'm cutting the video. Wow. <laughs> it's been pretty sparse over the last month or two. Um, but I just wanted to come on tonight, show a few cards, and uh, go get some sushi when I'm done. I'm drinking my iced matcha latte. Delicious. A little green tea action. And um, psyched that it's the weekend. And let's go. Let's show, show some cards. Uh, first two cards I'm showing are two more additions to the old Mike Lum run. Yeah, baby, Mike Lum. The first card is his 1974 Tops in a PSA 9. Very nice card. I, I did a video on Mike about, I don't know, about a month, month and a half ago, explaining why I'm doing Mike Lum. Um, so here's two more. The 74 and the 1980. Got that, as you can see, in a nice gem 10. I do have another one on its way. I have the 1981 Tops traded um, on its way. So uh, that'll be here probably in the next week or so. And then when I get uh, when I get when I get my next little batch of cards, I'll do another video. And then the last card I'm going to show today is a beauty. It's a beauty, and it is the 2005 Donruss Zenith Epics. Don Mattingly, the game in the black, the black game. And this card is numbered number nine out of 75. And there's the back. And I had been picking these up and I was kind of mistaken, I think, when I did the first video of the little rainbow that I had shown. Um, let me get my trusty notebook here because I have some notes. I didn't realize that this, um, this series or this, this, this uh, you know, these parallels had much more than I than I than I uh, than I knew about. So, what I can find on these is there's um, they do uh, one two three four. They do six different colors. They do orange, blue. They do purple, green, red, and black. And I could definitely find um, of orange, blue, and purple. There are four versions each of those okay so in orange you've got the orange play you've got the orange game you've got the orange season and you've got the orange moment and they're all numbered differently the play is out of 750 the game is out of 500 the season's out of 350 and the moment is out of 250 and then you go to the the blue okay and the blue has the same the play the game the season and the moment but the numbering is different. It's very crazy. It's really, to me, it's almost haphazard and random how they did this. So the blue play is numbered out of 500. The blue game is 350. The blue season's 250. And the blue moment's 150. So it's not the same as the orange. And then the purple, um, I guess as you go, the colors change, the numbers kind of... Um, they drop down a little bit. So the purple play is out of 350. The purple game is out of 250. The purple season is out of 150. And the purple moment is out of 100. Um, green. Uh, I see a green. There's a green on eBay right now. And I think it's the green season. It's going for a decent amount. I think it's uh, like $89.99 for a card numbered out of 75. So I'm watching it. The, uh, they do have an offer. Um, you know, make an offer um, option on there. I'll see. But now I can only find a green play, a green game, and a green season. I don't know if they have a green moment. And they're numbered 100 out of 150, out of 100, and out of 75 as I listed them off. And then you got red. Red play, red game, red season. Red play is 250. Red game is out of 150. And red season is out of 100. And then last but not least, you got the black play and the black game. Black play is out of 100. Black game is out of 75. That's this one right here. And I don't know if there is um, the black moment and the black season. I don't know. I looked and I didn't see that it, it, it existed. So I'm kind of 
going, you know, learning as I go along. But it's kind of a daunting, you know, it's very, it, it's, it's kind of all over the place. So um, it's definitely something I'm going to work on to complete. Um, it shouldn't be too difficult. I don't think it's going to be utterly difficult like some of the other stuff, but it's a fun little uh, little set. And if you have a player you like to PC, check check if they have a, uh, a 2005 Donruss, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> Zenith Epics as a choke. And that's it. I actually kind of like that. The black is really cool looking. And that's it, guys. That's what I've got tonight. A little little lesson on the uh, the Epics um, series. And uh, if you know anybody has any other knowledge on other parallels that exist that I may have missed, like the, if there are other versions of the black that I that I don't know about, just let me know. Uh, I do not profess to know everything. And uh, that's all I've got, guys. So have a great night. Enjoy your weekend. And I will see you on the next video. May the cardboard God shine down upon everybody out there. Let's go. Donnie, take us out. Bye-bye.